I stubbed my toe on the way to install this game. That was the most enjoyable part of the experience. I'm actually stunned speechless. This game is as bad as everyone is saying. God is dead, and the culling two killed him. I had over 700 hours in the culling, and this is by no means a sequel. It is a sad attempt at copying PUBG slash Fortnite to make a quick buck. I honestly think PUBG Mobile is more responsive. I would be ashamed to have even worked on this project. Xavier has exhibited some disturbing business practices, and I would be wary of purchasing any of their products or whatever company they become in the future. I refuse to believe that anyone could release a game like this and actually think it was finished, let alone contribute anything new to the BR community. I bought this just to leave a review and refund it because these devs need to know that they have royally screwed up. The character and environment textures are hideous. Bullets come from the third person camera instead of the gun. If you go back to back with a window and shoot, the window shatters. Animations don't make any sense. If you strafe, it looks like the character is walking forward. You can parachute into the starting area and the guns are still sitting on the tables, but you can't pick them up. This game is not a sequel, as The Culling 2 would lead you to believe. It is a blatant lie by a shameless development company. The first game was centered around rock, paper, scissors, melee combat, and bows with very little gunplay. It had a lot of interesting game mechanics from the crafting and loot drops, etc. This game is nothing but a very poorly done PUBG slash H1Z1 clone. Hopefully PUBG sues this company as well since it is an exact clone and will be an easy lawsuit to win, but it probably isn't worth it since this game isn't going to make any money anyway. Game is dead on arrival, played and streamed on release day, and can only find one other person in game. I literally had more viewers on my garbage stream than there were people playing the game. Don't buy unless you want to run around the map aimlessly firing guns that shoot like old people fart without ever encountering a single other player. I feel like this quote from the Culling 2 loading screen summarizes this game pretty well. I don't have no fear of death. My only fear is coming back reincarnated. Tupac Shakur. Culling should have been left dead. Damn, gave the game the benefit of the doubt because I still like the Culling 1 even after the changes the devs made. The Culling 2 just doesn't feel like a finished game, even though it is finished, it's a bare bones BR game. I don't want to call it an asset flip, but that's how it feels when you play it. You guys know how there's Papa John's, Pizza Hut, and Domino's? Well, this is like Little Caesars when you don't want to spend an extra $5 on your fast food. I'm disappointed because I defended the game, bought it, and felt unsatisfied with the product. This game is hot trash. I would say it is a budget version of Ring of Elysium, which is a budget version of Rules of Survival, which is a budget version of PUBG. This is first time I have left a review on a game. I felt so obligated to let people know how bad this game is before they spend their money on it. I have refunded it, and I will be donated $20 to charity instead. Holy what a train wreck. Remember the South Park episode where the boys cry about how George Lucas and Steven Spielberg Indiana Jones with the remake? Well, Xavier has the culling with this third person BR shooter remake trash. Fastest refund I ever requested. This is not the culling. It contains no elements of the original culling. It is more of a bad ripoff of PUBG and H1Z1. Do not buy. Do not give this dev team any money for this obvious cash grab. Very disappointing. I played alphas that play better than this. The best part was when I uninstalled this game. Xavier, you haven't learned from the first game. Dot dot dot. I refund that. It's not worth 20 euros. It's a money steal. Xavier is much stealer than Payday 2 crew this time. It's impossible to make a game terrible like that. It's look like PS3, badly animated, and look like a free to play. Crate, bad XP system, coin system to unlock skin, etc. Why? Space question mark. Worst graphics I have seen in over 10 years. Also spent 30 minutes waiting for people to join, but I guess the game is so dead it makes the first one popular. Never got to actually try it, but I saw enough. The development team officially killed themselves by making this disrespectful trash. LOL, you should be ashamed of yourself. You might as well refund everybody their money back because you have forever ruined the culling name. I already got my refund. It's pending, but it has been approved. I only played 30 minutes. I feel you should be sued. I know that sounds unreal, but wow, WTH, how did you think this game was going to survive? Space question mark period. You put zero time into this game and it flopped like a fish. Your only next move is to go back to the original culling and add more content to try and bring that game back to life. That's all you have. Yikes. This is not a finished game. It's a poor attempt or cash grab at combining H1Z1 and PUBG. This is not the culling.